What's good everybody, ASAP here, here to give you some quick tips on how to reach master rank. These are some tips that should really make your life as an ed player for modern a lot easier. If you could please like, share, and subscribe, it really helps me out. So let's get right to it. The first thing I'm gonna tell you is with ed, you have a lot of moves that require people to just easily get a, a free jump in on you. And let me show you a few. That's a free jump in right there. You have anyone that just decides to just jump your flicker, you gotta be careful of people jumping in on you. So that's the first thing. Be wary of throwing your special moves out because people will just just jump in on you. As an Ed player, when I go against Ed, I'm jumping in on them. So be careful of that. The second thing is anti-air. Your anti-air game needs to be on point with Ed because people are going to jump at you. And I mean, people will jump at you. I just told you the first reason why. So with the anti-air game, just keep it simple. Just keep it simple right there. And quarter circle back. Now the reason I say use the quarter circle back because sometimes that heavy will just miss, especially at the, at the wrong angle. And bam, they can punish you for that. So always do the light version. Cause even if you do it like the light version like too late, see, you're still plus four. So don't leave that damage on the table. They jump, hit them with that every single time. You need that, that's 14 damage. You need that right there. All right, the second thing is you need to throw a lot of strike grab mix-ups. You need to do a lot of low, a lot of lows into that. You need to grab a lot. Cause we do not have an overhead, so we need to be doing low strike grab. We need to be throwing a lot of grabs and making them think, okay, he's gonna, he's a grappling edge. That's what we need them to think. Cause then we're gonna start doing this. Start shimmying. Like once we get a grab, dash forward, they gonna grab, and that's a heavy auto three right there for you. But the third tip, Please throw in strike your grabs. Don't just strike all the time. Get your grabs in. Get your grabs in so that way you can start opening up your game. If you're not throwing in grabs, they're just gonna hold block and it's gonna be really hard for you to open them up. The fourth and final tip is we have, I don't know if you noticed, I hope you noticed by now, but our buttons are kind of slow. The fastest button we got is the down, down crouching and auto one but most of our buttons are really kind of slow so when you're getting pressured in the corner by ken who, who has four frame jabs it's kind of you'll notice it's kind of hard to match back with him see i'm trying to match my four frame jab back and i'm getting punished for it I will say with Ed, when you're in a corner, this is like literally the worst place you could be and you need to figure out a way to get out of it quickly. You just simply jump out or wait to block and then punish with that. So that's the best advice I can give you on that one. But really in the corner with Ed, it, it really sucks. You really don't want to be in the corner with Ed because our moves are too slow. And the only way we got people to get off us is a crouching light or a DP. So please be careful with that. And that's all I really get. Oh, and the last tip is combos. Obviously, you need to practice your combos. You need to get the maximum amount of damage with your combos. Because auto three, auto three only going to carry you so far. And now, trust me, it's only going to carry you so far. So please practice your combos. And that's really all I got. With that being said, please have a nice day. This is Green signing off.